Yo, 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 everybody. Welcome back to another exciting YouTube video where today I am going to go over a flavor that I've never played the game for. It says Armored Core V1 Fires of Rubicon. It actually looks pretty interesting. The flavor seems more interesting. I guess strawberry passion fruit is what it says. So let's go. everybody thank you so much for making it through that intro like always it is greatly appreciated because if you've made it this far then maybe i will get your attention for about another three minutes so let's go so this tub is um decently simple looking for the most part i mean it just looks like it's got some machines on it with guns and a little bit of background it's got some chaos going on and yeah so I am interested in strawberry passion fruit. Let's get this open. All right, so it is open clearly as you can see. I am struggling real bad opening these. I have no idea why. Uh, maybe my razor's getting dull after opening so many tubs. So remember if your stuff doesn't do this, then send it back to G Fuel because your seal should not be tampered with. Pop the top, give it a good smell. That smells delicious does not have a terrible smell at all that smells like something i will actually enjoy and the scooper is right here so that's awesome we're gonna go ahead and get this scooper dumped out refilled and we're gonna fill up our cup i'll be right back today's shaker is uh it's a glow in the dark shaker actually and my wife has bedazzled it out a little bit or bedazzled or redazzled or she's made it look beautiful so remember, drink responsibly 12 to 16 ounces of water. One scoop of G Fuel is to here and not here. So we are going to add contents to said water and put lid on, and we will be right back. We're going to give her a good shake up. All right, it is shaken up, and it is ready to go. Now, what I do to shake it up is I shake it up for about 15 to 30 seconds, let it sit, shake it up for about another 15 to 30 seconds, and then you should be good to go because I also shake it up in between each... Um, each drink so let's go ahead and pop this give it a smell I smell the strawberry now I'm not too big on passion fruit I like I, I like it I think but the, what I mean by I'm not too big on it is I don't really know like what it tastes like or what I'm sh shooting for or like I like it but I don't know if I like it like it you know what I mean I, I've never been turned away by anything that has passion fruit in it but I've never actually just ate a passion fruit just like dragon fruit I like dragon fruit stuff, but I've never actually ate a dragon fruit. So, all right, cheers, everybody. It's definitely front and foremost strawberry. And then maybe it does follow it with that passion fruit that I do taste a little something different after the strawberry, but it's not much passion fruit at all. I would have to say it's probably a 70 strawberry and a 30, a 70, 30 blend. It's really delicious. It's really cold. It might be as close to a strawberry, a normal strawberry flavor as I've ever tasted. G Fuel doesn't have a normal strawberry flavor. I think the only way that you can get a normal, like an actual strawberry flavor is one of the uh, Tetramino packets. I do think they have multiple flavors that like, they have a grape flavor in that, I think maybe, and an orange and then like a uh, strawberry. They have like normal flavors in there that you just can't get in tubs for whatever reason. So super solid right here. I mean, eight out of 10, it's really worth getting. It's nothing to scuffle at if you like your strawberry, if you like passion fruit. I really feel like it's foremost 70 to 75% strawberry. And then it's a, that, you know, that 30 to 25 passion fruit. So until next time, everybody, this has been your boy King Mo. Take care and stay hydrated. Peace. Much love. Deuces.